Legacy Network here at CES 2025, and we're at the HDMI booth with Tobias. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. HDMI has uh, some new exciting news this year. You have a new spec for the standard, uh, for the protocol of, uh, uh, you have 2.2 now. That's right. 2.2 brings even more bandwidth. Well, that's, that's what we're known for is bandwidth. So time to double it from 48 gigabits to 96 gigabit per second. That's the headline feature for HDMI 2.2. I love that. So we're going to be able to get higher resolutions. Yes. Uh, we're going to be able to do so much more with it. Now, now, what are, what are we what are we going to be capping out uh, capping out at now that we're at 2.2? What what's what? like 8K going to hit? Yeah. So there, there's two vectors that we're pushing here. One is resolution. So with this uh, boost in performance, we will be getting to 16K. The other uh, the other vector we're pushing is frame rate. And gaming is really pushing the boundaries of faster and faster frame rates. Yep. So we're going to see things. We're already starting to see 4K 240. We're going to see 4K 480. We're going to see it going beyond at higher and higher frame rates uh, due to this faster bandwidth. So DisplayPort eats your heart out. <laughs> you better catch up. That's right. So for a while there, DisplayPort 2.1 was kind of killing it pretty good, you know. And uh, and it's not so much that HDMI was falling behind. It's just a lot of the manufacturers, uh, NVIDIA, I, actually I shouldn't say anybody's NVIDIA, uh, <laughs> who decided not to push forward with anything with their 40 series, but they're finally doing it with 50 series. But I think, is 50 series going to be uh, taking on 2.2, or is it still 2.1? Uh, I, I can't speak directly to that, but uh, right now, the spec is just going to ship end of the first quarter, so so, uh, so products will be you know thereafter. So. Right. So we might have a a little while before we see something coming from Nvidia or some of these other manufacturers. So we might be still looking at 2.1 for a while, but likely by summer or the end of this year, we're going to start seeing 2.2 pop into devices. I'm that, sure that is a possibility. Yes. I can't wait for that. Uh, so this is exciting news coming from HDMI. Uh, the uh, the need for bandwidth is definitely there. Uh, as you said, being able to reach 16K is awesome. But like you said, uh, 4K, 240, I've hit that myself uh, when I actually find time to game. But uh, <laughs> when I do, I'm, I got uh, Samsung's 57-inch, uh, uh, their ultra, super ultra widescreen monitor mm -hmm. uh, that's able to do that. It looks amazing, you yes. know? So to be able to someday do that with HDMI is even better, especially at higher frame rates uh, and even higher resolutions. These games are just gonna get that much better. So it's just now launching out. You'll see more devices later on in the year, summer, maybe uh, fourth quarter of this year, as developers and manufacturers integrate uh, the new technology into their products. And of course, if you wanna hear more information about the new HDMI specs for 2.2, definitely go to HDMI's website hdmi.org. Come and check it out. That's an easy one to remember. So go check it out. Tobias, thank you so much. All right, well, thank and, you. And uh, we can't wait, always can't wait to see what comes next. It might be a little while before that happens, but for now, this gives us plenty of wiggle room to squeeze into as new technologies arrive. So this is Absolutely. great. Fantastic. If you want to stay on top of all the latest and greatest and or at least the gadgets we cover, remember to subscribe right here. Subscription button. Click it. You're going to want to. There's lots of videos, interviews, previews, all sorts of stuff. Button. Click it.